100% Chelsea, Chelsea nil, City nil, uh, losing the final on penalties. Having said that, multiple times tonight, it uh, doesn't get any better. No, uh, it's got us. Uh, I think any fan, anyone can say it's 50-50 when it comes to penalties. Like, you know, you come up with the five, your five best penalty takers, it comes down to if the keeper comes the right way or who's the most confident. Uh, but other than that, I thought if if it was going to be won in the, for, in the 90 minutes, it was going to be won by a wonder goal. Both teams played exceptionally well in two halves. It was a two-half game. Um, I thought uh, I was absolutely delighted that the heat, see that Emerson started and he showed that he can play against big teams. What the first choice for you now? Oh, hands down. It's it's not that I don't like Alonso. I think Alonso. I think Alonso is a good player. I think he is absolutely. He is a great player. But right back is or left back is not his natural position. It's a wing back. He likes to go forward. When he's in that kind of position, he is far more like if he, there was three defenders. If there was three at the back, he'd have less, a bit more or less. So in other words, he would he would look a bit more confident. But Emerson is natural in that position and I thought he gave the confidence in the likes of Rüdiger and David Luiz as well. He was, uh, David Luiz put on a great show there today. It was it was a game of defence really, um, even City defence, like you know, we were trying to put up the balls up there, couldn't get through. There wasn't really many big chances in it as well, but it was a great game of football, it was end to end in my opinion. Uh, but I thought we were a better team compared to out of the whole thing. The guy, there's no one that you can say was uh, bad today. The mentality was brilliant. The only thing is, is now is that are we going to see that going into Tottenham? Do you think we will? There's no excuse. There's no excuse. That's my thing. Is there is no excuse to be able to go in, go into Tottenham go and play Tottenham at home and not come out with that mentality what we did there today. You lose in penalties. Fair enough. To be honest, we done a lot fucking better than any other, probably another team that would probably done there today. So, um, it was just, I'm just, I'm just got, I'm just sad uh, that it ended that way. Uh, I'd say it'd be the same for City fans, it was the opposite, like, you know, um, but look, we just have to go in with mentality. Kepa was a bit of a fool, he made Sarri look like an ass um, there today at the end. The fellow went down injured twice. We should have put the keeper on there, fresh legs, um, someone there. All right, he did save a, he did save a shot in that, but Med Sari looked like a fool. I was on the other side, from the, from the from the where you can see the benches and that, and Sari was storming already straight down to the thing, and then he came back, and from what I hear, it was there. I was chatting with my dad. He was on the he was watching the game. He said he was practically at the doors. He was at the doors. He was fed up. It's either, I don't think it's people are going on about Sari getting get sacked. It's more to the fact that is Sari going to walk out. I think that's one thing that we need to look at because he's already come out saying that he's finding it hard to motivate these players. So, yeah.